I am here, Elizabeth Barrett Browning. Let me say a word, and that is, that I have listened to the last message that was written you, and if I could only utter from my soul, as that spirit did, the deep and true meaning of love and gladness, I would think that beyond the condition that I should then be in, there could not possibly be any starry heavens or beyond. I am a bright spirit and happy, but my happiness is not that which I saw in the bright spirit who wrote, and my love to his is like a pale moonbeam compared to the glorious sunlight. I wonder now that such a spirit can possess such a glorious countenance of love and sympathy. When he spoke of the love of the mother for her son, his whole soul seemed to go with his words and to reflect the wondrous love that he must possess. This is the first time that I have ever attempted to write through a mortal, and my astonishment is great that I can do so with such ease. But I realize that it must be because there are so many beautiful spirits present encouraging me to do so. You should be a very happy mortal to have all these glorious spirits around you and so close to you, and they all seem to love you so very much. And as I write, they smile upon you and they say that they love you, not only because they are your parents and relatives, but because in your heart, I refer to both you mortals, there is a love that responds to theirs and recognizes the fact of the mutuality of the affections. Tell me, what is the secret of this? To me, wonderful attraction, and what this love is, for it must be beyond what I have experienced. Well, I have heard what you said, and one beautiful spirit comes to me, and says that she is a countrywoman of mine, and invites me to go with her for a little talk and says that her name on earth was Kate, and now is a child with a father and a possessor of his love, which she says is a part of the love that I see all around me. How wonderful this all is, and how I long to be among these beautiful spirits in their beauty and happiness. Well, I have to leave now and learn the secret of the love, so thanking you, I say good night, your true friend, Elizabeth Barrett Browning.